Hey girlfriends, today I'm going to show you how you too can create this classic glam look using all drugstore products. If you'd like to see how to do it yourself, stay tuned and subscribe to make sure you never miss an upload. Let's get started. So I always like to prime first to let the primer settle into my skin so it can really work. Today I'm priming my eyes using Wet n Wild and my face using my Maybelline Master Prime. I then apply tape to the outer edge of my eye for a sharp edge and apply my powder all over my lid to help my shadows apply smoother. I'm now applying the bronzer from the e.l.f. Turks and Caicos palette into my crease as a transition shade. Wet n Wild makes some of my favorite drugstore eyeshadows so today I'm using their Comfort Zone palette and I'm just going to be placing that color I showed you underneath my brow bone and then blending it in. Now I'm going to take this second color here and pat that color, pack it all over the lid and then go back in and blend in the crease again. Taking that next color you see there, I'm going to go in the outer V of my eye and blend that some more. With my ring finger, I'm applying the gold from the Milani Fierce Foil Eyeshadow and Florence Palette all over the lid for added shine. Then using the dark brown from the Comfort Zone Palette, I'm applying that into the outer V and a little into the crease for added definition in that area. And I just pack the color on more and continue to do the same process till I get the look that I desire. I'm now going to wing out my liner and check out my tutorial on wing liner for details on how I like to do my wing eyeliner. I wanted a bronze goddess look so I'm using the dark uh, color from my e.l.f. Turks and Caicos bronzing duo to chisel and bronze my cheeks, nose, and the infamous five head. And of course, I'm jamming that lemonade, baby. What songs do you like to get ready to? Let me know in the comments below. For my blush, I'm using my favorite drugstore blush, which is Milani's Luminoso. I love orange coral blushes, and this gives the perfect flush and sheen to the cheeks. So I'm now prepping my lips for my lipstick using my e.l.f. Lip Exfoliator and scrubbing my lips down. And then I'm going to, of course, apply my handy dandy chapstick. Now using the same cream color I used earlier on my brow bone, I'm going to place that color in my inner tear ducts. And then I'm placing the dark brown in the palette on my, or across my lower lash line. Now push through highlights. I'm using Elf's bronzer in the color Sunkiss. This highlight really makes me feel myself. She better work. Yes. Now girl, what's a classic glam makeup look without a red lip? For long wear, I like to line and fill my lips. And I'm using my Rimmel liner in Red Diva. And then I'm going to apply my Wet n Wild lipstick in Red Velvet on top of it. And if you're wondering, I do fill in my entire lip with my liner before I apply my lipstick. So after you apply your lipstick, apply your lashes and mascara and slay girl. Thanks for watching and don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe, and let me know what types of videos you'd like to see. Remember, beauty is not one size fits all, so keep being your own type of beautiful boo. Ooh, for sorry, let me love more, but you know Ooh, for sorry, let me love